Revelation 989. From the 1st of July 1939. Reference to severe suffering. Power of prayer. The later times will teach you that you can only escape from misery and distress with divine help and that the door to eternity must be passed by everyone and again without divine help. The right way will hardly be found. If man is not able to cope with the efforts of his own strength, he has to turn to the eternal Godhead for help if he wants to reach his goal. And if you pay attention to the coming time and notice how the burdens will descend heavier and heavier upon you, when you will feel the pressure that is put on you from the outside, and if you often get into situations in life where you would like to despair and face life completely discouraged, then remember that you have a sure means of help. Prayer. You are still to be called immeasurably rich in all misery, as long as you may turn to the Father in heaven in supplication. You are not helpless and forsaken, but one is always ready for you. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. And there is no need so great on earth that it cannot be remedied through prayer. And remember that you need nothing more than a heart turned to the Father in love and faithful trust that he will not let his child be called in vain. Leave all fear and doubt aside, and trustingly lay all your worries at the feet of the Father, he always knows what is right for you, and he only waits for your call, through which you acknowledge him as Father. And the burden will be taken from you and his love will refresh and comfort you in all suffering. Only do not forget that one is over you, who takes an intimate interest in you and whose love is for you children of the earth. Do not forget that all suffering is imposed on you only for the purpose that you may remember the Father therein and approach him for help. For by prayer you confess him as your Father and thus consciously enter into childlike relationship with the Father. And your prayer will be heard if you believe without doubt. Amen.